Okay, my first callback of uh, 2022. Gonna check this out. It says the air conditioning stopped working. Old Goodman. We'll see if it's done. Hopefully it's a capacitor. That's what I'm hoping. All right, let's see. Okay, Yahoo. It's not a callback um, so far. It is not, I did work on the outside condensing unit. This time the fan, the blower assembly inside the house is not working. So we have no air blowing whatsoever inside the house. Um, so let's see what's going on. Got to go up in the attic. I'm glad it's like four o'clock in the afternoon. At least it's cooled off. About 70 degrees out here right now, which is cool. Looking at Miguel. California. Okay. Got a carrier furnace here. Uh, customers complaining. No heat. Ah, just joking. <laughs> no cooling. No fan. I know nothing works. I found a tripped circuit breaker um, outside at the uh, circuit breaker, breaker panel, the FAU. So, uh, I'm just going through and looking for some shorts and that sort of stuff, burn stuff, you know, to see before I turn it on. But I um, haven't found anything. All I found so far is uh, 20 ohms across the plug when I push in the switch here. And that I found is the transformer. So I don't know if that's uh, if that's normal or not. So I'm thinking I don't have another transformer on the truck, damn it. So uh, I'm thinking I'm just going to try it and see if it trips again. 20 ohms could be just the transformer itself. Um, I think I would like to see more ohms than that. But uh, anyway, I'll just give it a shot if it trips again. I know I have to come back and put a transformer on it. Uh, I don't want to, like I said, I don't have a transformer on my truck. I usually do, but I just don't right now. Um, so, board looks all right. Um, I don't see any burn spots on the board. So, so I wonder, can I turn on the light while I do in the movie? Wonder, I think. I don't know. I don't think. I don't know what that does. The white button. Uh, anyways. Let's see. Alright, so. Let's see. Okay. Let's see. Turn on the light. Okay, and now I have the light on. Let me see if I can see down in here. See if we got any. Nope, that's the wrong end. So let's see. I can see from this end. But I see anything. I can see anything. So we had a blown fuse on the board right here. The fuse was kind of loose. I tried it with my little tripper thingy and everything's fine. There's the there's the fuse. It's definitely blown. Um yeah, but I'm gonna have a look in here. They had a power outage, so. I don't know if the power going on and off did it or something, but this doesn't look kosher either. This is all rotted away. The, there was a, I saw there was a coupling in there, a plastic bushing thing, but it's all rotted away. So I'm guessing this thing must be about 20 years old or something. There's a tag. If you guys can see what age it is, I can't read nothing right now. Serial, what does it say, 20? 898 so that would be 1998 yeah so this thing's old um yeah, 
we don't use heat much in California. Look at that heat exchange around. <laughs> Look at that thing. It's, uh, hasn't even, like, brand new. Heat's never been used, I don't think. Anyways, let me just open this up and see if we got a loose wire or something in here, but it's all kinds of loose, little bits of loose wire, so just kind of going through it a little bit. Well, it's working again. Nothing really definitive that I found wrong. It's kind of like you loose fuse a little bit. But the fuse was pretty loose in the fuse holder on the board and the, some of the wires weren't really pushed on that great. And the outside, I think mainly what I found is the uh, wire to the outside condensing unit is all just deteriorated and the sprinklers are blowing out there. So I'm thinking the water on the sprinklers every day and stuff got on the wire and shorted it out. So I'm going to replace that wire. It's all it's pretty far gone outside, so I'll give you a picture of that. But it's all going. You can you can hear it's going. Um, you can hear it going. I should have the red light. Maybe you guys can see. Yeah, there's a red light. So uh, yeah, 1998 unit. She's an old girl. So uh, anyways, you know what we got up here? Installation or something. Anyway, I'm getting out of here. It's, I don't know what time it is. God, it's got to be 6 o'clock, 7. Pretty close to sunset or whatever. Saturday. Emergency call. Came in late yesterday afternoon. So, anyhow, i got a fan over there. I'm not going to deal with that box. The box fell off while I was here. It's like, I'm not going to deal with it right now. Too late. Got the thing going for him. So, got to replace that wire outside still. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna replace this uh, thermostat wire. I just think there's some spots that are getting kind of eaten through and there's a sprinkler underneath. I just had them put that thing over the sprinkler because that sprinkler is just like probably flooding this area and I noticed you know, some nicks and stuff. And so I separated and everything runs now, but I'm just gonna replace that wire, call it done. Okay, so there's thermostat wire done. So, I just made a little, used my half inch drain that I use for uh, half inch PVC or uh, plastic or whatever, vinyl, half inch vinyl. Just use that since there's no like box or whatever there just to keep the weather off of it. So that'll work. Is a half inch Romex fitting. So, pretty cool. I'm gonna put a wire tie. I'll put a wire tie on that and strap it up. But, and, all right. Thanks for watching. Click like on the video, subscribe. Thanks, bye.